Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you through a stretching routine that will get you ready for the rest of your day. Go ahead and roll out your mat and let's begin. Let's start by tucking our chin to our chest, feeling a stretch through our neck and upper back, and take your gaze upward towards the sky. Drop your right ear to your right shoulder and reach your left arm away. Really reach far away from you so you feel a good stretch. Take your gaze down towards the floor. And turn your gaze up to the sky. Coming back up, let's switch sides. Drop your left ear to your left shoulder, reach your right hand away. Gaze down to the floor. And gaze up to the sky. Slowly return your head back to neutral and let's go on all fours. We'll move into cat-cow. Be sure that your breath aligns with your movements. So as you drop the belly for cow, inhale and exhale, pull the belly button in to the spine, round the back for cat. Go at your own pace. Moving into our next exercise, take your right leg forward to a runner's lunge. Place your weight on your left hand and open up the right arm. Twist through to touch your left thigh with your right hand. Keep your breath going. One more here. Place both hands down and slowly extend the front leg. Bend it to bring the hips forward again. Extend the leg, feeling a stretch in the back of the legs. Good, let's go ahead and switch sides. Place your weight on your right hand now and open up your left arm, opening up the chest, reaching the left arm through, touching your right thigh. Place both hands down and slowly extend the front leg. Ease into the stretch. We don't want to pull very hard, just a slight tug. Good job, moving on, you can sit your butt on your heels. And we're going to do some spinal rolls. So tucking the chin to the chest, round the back as much as you can. Extend those arms out in front of you and really reach away for a greater stretch. Now let's reverse this movement. Come through a neutral spine. Take your arms behind you and opening up the front of the chest.
relax out of that bring the hands forward tuck the chin to the chest round the spine again for a greater stretch you can clasp your hands behind your head and just do a little tug coming out of that let's open up the chest again so take those arms back Let's do that just one more time. very good slowly come out of that and let's straighten the legs out in front of us start by inching your way forward reaching the hands to the feet and we'll reverse that pull the belly button in towards the spine rolling down as slow as you can all the way down Tuck the chin to the chest, reach with the fingertips, coming all the way up and over, getting a good stretch in the back of the legs. If you're unable to come up with your legs straight, you can bend your knees and hold on to your thighs to help assist you as you come up. This should feel really good on your spine. We'll do just one more. Great job. Let's make our way onto our belly now. So when you get there, take your feet about mat distance apart and your hands close to your side. Straighten your arms, bringing the chest up for Cobra. If you're not ready to do Cobra yet, you can be on your forearms for Sphinx Pose. Or if you would like something in between, you can straighten your elbows for Seal Pose. Come down to rest. Rest your cheek on your hands. Let's get ready to move back into whatever pose feels good for you this morning. Slowly release yourself back down. Let's come up again. Really lift through the crown of your head up to the sky, pressing the tops of the feet down into the ground. And come out of that. We'll do that one more time. Press your hips back towards your heels for child's pose. Rest your forehead on your mat. Reach your hands far away from you. And breathe. Thank you for joining me today for this stretching routine. I hope you feel warm and ready for the rest of your day. Feel free to stay in child's pose as long as you need. Have a great rest of your day and I'll see you next time.